Hey guys, in this video I would like to see whether the Sony Xperia C is really waterproof. Sony claims that it is waterproof for up to 30 minutes and for up to 1 meter underwater. So now we are going to test the device. As you can see, the touch screen is completely functional, working as it should. So now let's slowly dip the mobile phone into this um, fruit bowl, which is pretty deep. Um, you know, it almost goes up to the halfway point. Um, it is normal for the touch screen to register touches um, when the device is only partially in water or being run under a tap um, because it is basically registering touches. This is completely normal. Um, once the device is, however, um, fully submerged, it won't be able to register touches because it's going to think that the whole screen is being touched by the um, body of water. So it is not possible to really use the um, touch screen underwater and it won't be able to, it won't be possible to use the touch screen above water again until the screen is fully dried. So let me quickly dry the front of the screen, unlock it, and as you can see here, the phone is still fully functional, which is good. Um, and the one downside of the phone not being functional underwater is that you are unable to um, take pictures by clicking on the shutter button in the camera app. And the phone obviously doesn't have a physical camera button, which is a bit of a pain. Um, there's one easy workaround for this. If you go into the camera settings and go to self-timer, you can set it to 2 seconds or 10 seconds. Um, then you can obviously click the um, shutter button above water and when you um, take the phone below water, it will take the picture. There is also a um, smile feature where it will take a picture if it sees you smiling underwater. Um, and you also might be able to find the third party app which allows you to use, you know, the volume button as um, the camera button, etc. Um, flash should also work underwater. So I'm now going to click the camera button, put the phone underwater. Let me quickly wipe the screen. Okay, now let's unlock it. And now, if we go to our pictures, you can see that it took that picture without any issues. Nothing exciting to take a picture of, really. But it was able to take a picture underwater, um, with flash turned on using the self-timer option. Um, so yeah, that is um, pretty much it for this video. Tell me what you think of this feature. Um, do you have this device? And if you have this device, have you, you know, tried submerging it underwater yourself? Um, are you tempted to get the device because of this feature? Would you like to see this device on, this feature on, you know, a particular device in the future? Um, so yeah, that is pretty much it for this video. Click the like button if you liked um, this video. Click the subscribe button to see more videos like this in the future. And thanks for watching.